Hi, this is Justice with Tablet Pro. In this video, I'm going to be going over the new changes and improvements to the version 4 of the pen tool. So I'm very excited about this. There's a whole bunch of new improvements and quite a few coming. So if you don't have the pen tool yet, check it out. All right, so pen tool, we have a simplified mode for those who don't want anything to switch, nothing to change on its own, just change what the side buttons on the stylus do one time and keep them the same for everything. That's these buttons right here. This is a two button stylus. I have these on my website if you need one for art. Um, that's www.tabletpro.com. So this is the invert button. I'm gonna bring it next to the screen. You see invert turns red and the barrel button turns orange. Those colors have no significance. So barrel is what's typically known as the right click button. On a Surface Stylus, this is the Bluetooth button. When you use it on the screen, it is called Invert. You can see that it's going into range as I bring this close to the screen. And this is the Barrel button, the right-click button. This is the Invert button on this stylus, and this one also has an Invert um, eraser on the other end. Uh, not yet available. So this here, if you want to change what these buttons do, go to input mode, tap here, it will say none by default. You can put the cursor right in the middle and then tap whatever key you want and whatever modifier you want. And click apply. Okay, so you can see control C. Now you have advanced options. You can go in here and you can choose between hotkeys or clicks, and this will sequence through all of these. That means if we want to have, uh, let's say we want to click a couple buttons on the screen. So let's say we want to click right here, here, and here. Choose click, click, click. This is a terrible idea because we are actually still uh, on a floating window, so this will move. Okay, barrel, so we're gonna press it. And you can see what this does. It's really cool for a lot of programs that don't have keyboard shortcuts for certain things. And I will be adding these to the Bluetooth button, which means you can, from across the room, click up to six sequential locations and alternate between hotkeys and locations by pressing the uh, Bluetooth button. So cool. Actually, I'm very excited about it, actually. Okay, so if you guys uh, like the pen tool, please rate it. There's an option right here. You can click right here and it'll bring you to the Windows Store. It will bring you to the Microsoft Store. Scroll down right here and there's an option for rating right here. I would love to get this to a four star or higher rating. So please, if you like or use the pen tool and you want it to improve, or you appreciate the features, even if they're not perfect, please give us a great rating. Uh, I would immensely appreciate it. All right, so here is the invert button, and I'll go through what these different modes do outside of just the input mode. And if you wanna go back to the basic one, just click here on simple. You have just one option to remap, just right there. Once those are done, just click on apply and it will change what your button does. All right, that's it for this first video. Uh, stay tuned and I'll go through each of the different sections here and we'll talk about the advanced features. 